Are you coming, sir? Yeah, I'm coming. coming. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Good morning, ma'am. Take a seat. Thank you, ma'am. Give me your resume. Thank you. Okay. Your name is Raju Indukuri, right? Yes, sir. Tell me something which is not there in a resume. Speak something here. Yeah. Don't yeah. be nervous. Yeah. Uh, my hobbies. Speak something. I think you are acting too smart. I'm just asking. Uh, can I speak about oh, hobbies? When we are asking you a question, you need to answer. Why you are posing me? Bye. I'm sorry for that. Yeah. Mm. Speak yeah, my interested uh, uh, areas are. Uh, Finance, as I mentioned in the resume, and I'm beyond asking, that, tell yeah. me something which is not there in your resume. You are again saying Go the same thing. Oh, sorry. Who want these papers? <laughs> we are asking beyond that. By seeing this, we can say you what you are. Yeah. Uh, I'm asking. She is asking beyond yeah. that. Uh, we need to say that. Yeah. Uh, I've done a project. I've done a project. Uh, Stock markets. Uh, okay, where you have done? I did it in uh, uh, Wazir. What you have learned from? Uh, I learned uh, what are stocks, how what is share, what is uh, a stock market, kind of. And how did it help you uh, in your professional career by making some? Uh, Knowledge in stock market project. Yes. What? How did it help you in your professional career? First of all, uh, this is a part of our uh, uh, MBA program. This is part of your curriculum. That's why you have done the project, or else you won't do the project. That's what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Then what is the use of it? Have you learned anything from your project or you have just uh, visited there and coming and going every day? Yeah, I learned uh, many things from this project as I think I already told you. I, to, I learned uh, what is uh, equity share, what is uh, stock market, uh, what is uh, share market uh, kind of things uh, my project in, in YSA. Have you done anything out of box with your self-interest? Anything out of box with your self interest, any market research? Out of box. Out of box. Not considered, not with respect to MBA. Any other any projects? Any extra curricular activities? No, any other projects regarding MBA, not with college. Out of, no, out of college, out of box. Any presentations? Yeah, out any of uh, box means uh, I did many things uh, like. Uh, can you mention some of the things? I was uh, very active uh, in playing cricket. I was part of my college okay. cricket team. Okay. How it will help in your career? Yeah. Don't take so much of time. I have so many people to interview. Take another. With killing our time. Yeah. Yeah. I, as uh, you are telling, madam, uh, I gave some presentations uh, uh, related to uh, mini projects, uh, summer internship projects. Uh, in addition to that, my faculty also asked me many projects uh, to be done uh, and asked us to do the presentation. So I had been doing uh, all these kind of presentations. What is the typical role for a person to get a job in an organization? Can you say? I didn't understand. Can you please repeat the question? Like, uh, what is the role of a person in an interview uh, while going into the organization? What he must do? He should be uh, hardworking nature. Hardworking. Hard team hard player. You are thinking the work is hard. 
So, in the sense, uh, uh, as Sarah was saying, out of the box, someone should know. You should work love beyond. the work. Uh, yes. It's not to the hard work. You have to love your work. Then you can get success. Okay, are you thinking you are in a proper attack? Yes, yes ma'am. I am in the dress code. Okay, what about your beard? I didn't get my blazer, sorry. Hey, can you tell me what is the difference between smart work and a hard work? And which one would you prefer? Uh, by nature, I am hard working, but as uh, ma'am was saying, I should be smart enough. So I will learn uh, how to be smart and so on. So that. Uh, so you want to join the organization first and you want to learn the smart work? So you, so you currently don't have some smart working nature? Not exactly like that. Uh, what I'm trying to say is I will fit into your organization based on your needs and uh, customized uh, uh, expectations. Okay, explain me. Why should I hire you? We have so many applicants. We have uh, hundreds of applicants here. Why should I hire you? My, hundreds of applicants. My uh, academics are good. Even we got better resumes than yours. So, do you think only academic knowledge is enough to do any work in organization? Only academic qualifications? I agree with you, sir. Uh, we should be out of the box, as you mentioned uh, in the beginning. Uh, I had been doing that, but may maybe I am not able to present uh, properly. But I assure you that uh, whatever uh, the job I am assigned with, uh, I will be successful in my uh, uh, professional life after my do you know about the job description? Uh, we were told that uh, it was an analyst job. Uh, which analyst? Equity, equity analyst. Okay. Uh, it is related to finance or accounts? Uh, it was a finance job. Uh, Do you know what is the main basic difference between the finance and accounts? Finance? Is there any difference or not? One way there is a difference, but the other way they are similar. Uh, right now I am not getting the points, if not I would have explained you. But I am sure I am uh, uh, clear on the difference between uh, uh, finance uh, and account. How will you improve your, um, how will you improve our organization uh, by working smarter? Like, in what way you will work smarter? Give some example. Smarter in what sense? Smart, so that the work is simpler, simplified. Smarter uh, is all about uh, managing the things in a better way. Yeah, I'm asking how managing, but how, are, how you will? I need examples. Uh, for example, if you assign me some job to do in a specific uh, period of time, then I will try to fulfill that uh, even less than that time given to me. If I ask you to analyze 100 stocks uh, in a single day, can you? Sure. 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 Uh, come on, man. How can you? I will, I will definitely do that, madam. You are overconfident. Uh, Obviously. Don't do false promises. If you can't do this, just say it. Just express it. Don't do false promises. Because we don't need any false people. We need the people who can work for us. Not the people who can give the false promises because a person cannot uh, analyze a hundred stock in a single day. Um, we are experienced, we have an experience of 30 years now, now also we are not uh, uh, analyzing the stocks of 10 also in a single day. How you are saying that? Yes ma'am. Okay, fine, it's nice talking to you. Uh, do you possess any technical skills or um, any special uh, software programs uh, which is helpful to our organization? I re technical skills. I registered for MOOCs. Okay. Any technical courses? Technical any technical skills or any courses you have pursued? I am planning to do. Let's talk about your strengths. What are your strengths? What are your strengths? Don't you have any strengths? Uh, I I passed uh, my graduation in uh, first grade and I'm okay. also doing. Uh, is it a strength? Man, she is asking about strengths. You are saying about your graduation now. Why do you need that? 
you know what is meant by strength? I am asking what you are good at. What you are strong in. Anything. I think he is not fit for a job. What do you say, guys? Okay, it's a good discussion. Uh, can you rate yourself in a scale of 1 to 10? For this session, you have answered the questions. My performance. Yes, I got regarding your performance. Can you rate yourself from 1 to 10? <laughs> you should be genuine. You should be genuine. Yes, sir. So, why do you think yourself you are giving a rating of 10? What What are you looking for? I am perfect at this. I have these skills. I have this knowledge. So, what are you thinking of them? Because I have been answering uh, all your questions. Okay. You answering is not enough. Do you think that the answers are correct? What you, okay. What are your expectations? Any salary expectations? Nothing. No expectations. Then we will uh, we'll give you 5,000 per month. You have to work uh, for 9 to morning 9, 9 to 9 p.m. And you don't have any weekends. Will you work with us? <coughs> I cannot to say yes for that, but uh, I will be happy then, if you. It is up to you. What is your goal? I want to become an analyst, and uh, very fortunately, your company came to our campus. I was so happy. If you got any other opportunity better than this, will you shift to that company? No. No. If you got 50,000 per month and they are asking you to work for 9 a.m. to 3 p.m., will you work for them or for us? Definitely for your company, man. Why? Because uh, as I already told, I was telling sir, I want to work with your company. Any one capability that I am fit in this? I am. Uh, I will take the orders, whatever my boss gives me. Everyone will, will take the orders. Uh, that's what uh, I would. I can see only that. I think he is wasting our time. Okay. Uh, we will contact you soon. Thank you. Thank you, you. Thank you much. Thank you. Thank you.